Hello, hello everyone. Welcome. Bogmod here. And, uh... So we are fighting the Ottomans. And I kind of want to try and be greedy. So we're gonna, we're gonna push for that. Let's see. 13th of July, 7th of July. So we're gonna hang out there. You don't you don't wanna you don't wanna visit? Oh. Well that was a tricky of you. But I've got my troops there. So, well, that's eighty four. It's forty three. Ten new troops. You know what? I'm gonna take. I'm gonna go with those four. Seven, twenty, sixty-nine. Hold on. So that's that's a province of thirty-six, fifty-two. Oh, that would be fifty-seven for three. Oh, but it's more willing. Um, uh, ah! Is that right? Did I do the math right? And then, oh, I need to double check. Um, are you in what region is this? Ankara. Yeah, Ankara would do it. Now, like I said, I do kind of want to be greedy, so let's hold off a little. Let's see what happens if we wait. So sadly, because of Constantinople, I cannot make the push. Can some of the diet? A market there? Sure, I can. I can do a marketplace here. Why not? Provinces. Let's delay a little, see what happens. Because the other nice thing about what I'm doing 
is that this is also giving Austria that chance to unite itself and break them. Uh, Kanye needs salt, apparently. At a full half ducket? Hmm. All right, skip on sin up, but I demand. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. Because this will give us mission fulfilled Anatolian turnabout. We get a permanent claim in the Anatolia region. We get Turkic unions for as long as we accept Turkish as a culture. Uh, and we, we get it as a culture. So, bam! I did not ever. I, I did lose some fights with the Ottomans. So, you know. I do have to live with that. Is reorganize the state and act modernize it for tier one government reform. Modernize Gets ten janissaries. I can place pashas. I can enables tribal federation ability. A separatism. More governing capacity by reorganizing the state. Modernize Turkoman federation. I don't know what that is. All right, well let's let's slap that button. Mm, abolished. Here we go. Modernized confederation. We're still retaining some of the old tribal characteristics. Our government is a reformed federation with a modern institution inherited from foreign countries. Okay. Modernized Turkoman Federation. We're still a Shadam, so we're still a monarchy. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, and a gunpowder empire. It's covered for centuries. Changing nature of warfare forces us to adopt new technologies. Okay, what do we get? We get cheaper artillery, more land fire damage, a excellent commandant who's 75 percent cheaper and 10 army professionalism yeah, yes and then as core I feel I still have room left to take this idea. Uh, no, we will actually hold off. Since we're, we're close to being able to get that. Increase my sugar production. So let's, let's take a little little look. Janissary infantry. All right, so I get I get ten janissaries. Even though technically I, I shouldn't have them. I'll work with that. Let's take a look at ourselves. 961. Okay. Rules are still big. But we have we have definitely we've we've pushed the Ottoman down.
And we're gonna keep that that trend going. I was kind of expecting them they would eventually fight the various hordes out there. I could probably eat a little bit. You know what? We're going to build a spy network on Kazan. And we're going to try and take Kazan, the province of Ustjurt, from them. To feed to my uh, Gazakumuk. There we are, see? Permanent claims on the whole... Oh, even... Even over there. Really? Nice. And it is a permanent claim. Of course, very handy for us. All right, so we are we are well on our way now. I think. Well, I'll wait to see how the Ottomans are surviving after this. But I think. I think the Ethiopia issue is no longer a factor. I think. Well, hold on. So. Tunis just wants this province, but not the rest of them. So I think I can afford to piss off Tunis by taking that province from them. What's my manpower is recovered. Come. And of course, by coring or by having this culture accepted, we don't suffer any penalties. For example, I think down in here. Yeah, so see, because we don't accept Syria, we lose about a third of the money, of the taxes we could be getting out of. But thankfully, this is all 100%. If I put bag, you can have the university there for 10 years. Cheaper ideas and piety accelerator. You know what? Okay. Two points. House of Wisdom. So, prestige 90. And having done or in our golden era. And it would extend our golden era. There we go, we got the galleon, everybody! And early frigates. Uh, 
There we are. What was the piece? Zeta split Zadar, Vidin, Niglu, Ternovu, Branica, Nish, and Kosovo to Austria. So where where are where are they now? Seven hundred and thirty-six. All right, well that's good for me. I'll take the points. Thank you. Our air is infertile. Minus fifty percent chance of an air. It's not great. Not great. There we are. Soldiers' households, forced marching, Tech 14. We'll grab that shortly. Russia, ooh. Russia would join them. Hmm. Afshered Reformed Infantry. So I think See if we can threaten them. There we are. There you are, buddy. I mean, it's nothing huge, but it is free growth. I don't know if I actually have any reason to go to war with you. Trade dispute. All right, so yeah, we're definitely going to have to build a spy network. I can probably push quick enough that whatever long term. Ooh. There are some options here. So here's what I'm thinking I start the war, I quickly crush uh, the Mamluks. Ooh. Thank you, game, for just throwing money at my face. Hmm. OK. 
Okay, or... or. See, I think that's what we're going to do. We'll make a hard push, and then I can make bad things happen to Russia without ever having to fight Russia by just leaning heavily enough on the Mamluks, who will have to surrender. That said, I am going to reinforce a couple forts just to be safe. Which works out fine as I need uh, this to happen anyways. I can reduce their their manpower recovery. Might as well. Where can I put you? Where? Oh, perfect. Um. We're going to go back to economy, we're going to debase the currency for 500 bucks, and then I'm going to use this, get rid of two corruption, and another manufacturer. Two siege is good. I three four three two is, is a very acceptable leader. We can take a little break here, and then we'll, we'll come back and be like, all right, time to smash them once again. So stay tuned for the smashing. And then, once that's done, I might start to work on a, um, a one more merchant. Yeah, probably. Hmm. I might shift. When I get an extra, that'd be transfer wealth to there. Or, I might start to try and collect money from Constantinople. Oh, there's a lot of, a lot of options, a lot of ways this money can flow that I gotta consider. But thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in a bit.